Batman has an idea. <laughs> what does Batman have to say? Batman says you should have listened to our last video. Wait. <laughs> Don't they have to belong to the group? Because we... Uh, yes. This is, this is live on everywhere right now. This is live um, everywhere, but our last video was extremely long, and we apparently think that you don't have a life, and you could watch a 20-minute <laughs> video. We watch a lot of things for a long time, and they are nothing to us. Yeah, binge watch us. There you go. <laughs> exactly. I don't so, know. No, it was a good video. Us. I know it was long. It was about 20 minutes. Mm. It was long. Take some time. Put headphones as you're driving or something. It was there was a lot of information, and we even got like out of the normal what we were talking about towards the end, and it was just really good. So. Yeah. So if you're into BDSM, beating your spouse, it's a great video. No. This is no, no, honey. <laughs> but if that'll get you to watch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just kidding. <clears throat> so we uh, talk about power exchange. Yeah. Um, how to do that in and outside of the bedroom, mm -hmm. and um, the things that go along with power exchange, and the prerequisites like a class that you need to have before you try something that advanced sexually. Sexually. All right. So, so anyway, but today we want to talk about something really quick, and I, it's something you guys can put into practice in your own. This marriage. is pretty well, much just watch that too. video, and we'll see you next. Okay. Week. No. Really, really quick. I something happened this last week. Uh, we were camping. And we had a little tussle because we, I mean, we don't have big knockdown drag out fights anymore, I know I but hurt. we have, um, but we quickly diffuse stuff and we've learned how to diffuse things. And so you, we obviously have disagreements. You have disagreements. You have little, you get irritated with each we're other. We're perfect. We do these videos and these people think that we're perfect. So we're perfect all the time. It's always nice to not be perfect and to argue in front of your friends. Speaking we're that stuff. couple. We're that couple. <laughs> <laughs> and we did. And you know what? I don't even know if they knew that we were real. arguing to be honest Who with knows? you. But, <clears throat> No, but very simple thing. What happened was um, we packed up everything from the lake to head back to the campsite, and Tim was breaking down all of the big blow up stuff. So I grabbed everything. I was from, sucking the air I out of the inner thought tube. I grabbed everything from the beach, and we get home, and he's like, "Did you get this back?" And I'm like, "Well, yeah, it's got to be somewhere." And it was 30 minutes away, and I, well, it has to be here. And he's like, "Well, where is it?" I'm like, "Well, I don't, I don't know." <laughs> I, I'll look for it, and he says, "Well, it's not here." I go, "Okay, well, what was in it? It was that thing. It was like a." Something we got for free. It was free a privacy tent. That we got for and free. we all need privacy. And it was a cheap bag. I mean, it was like, okay, that, that wasn't any big deal. If I happened to leave it on the beach, I littered, but I don't really feel that bad about You're leaving just, something. Because it was all free. Be, right. It wasn't like a cell phone or a wall or something that we would have to go back for. So I'm like, it's okay. Just get over it. He goes, well, I asked you if you had everything. I'm like, and I thought I did. So we're literally getting like this voice with each other this tone and people were around <laughs> like, whatever everybody had disagrees with. he's like well i was really wanting that i don't know what else was in that bag i'm like well i don't know and we can and i go why are you so upset about this bag that really means nothing I what is the I big deal that much. <laughs> and what did you say to me i said it's not about the bag it's not about the bag we should actually post a link to that video so people understand it's not about the bag and it didn't matter what it was about, if it was an important item or an insignificant item, is that I placed concern on that item. And as my spouse, I want you to have that same concern regardless of what it is. So for example, if she would have said, hey, did you get those dead batteries? I would have made sure that I went and got those dead batteries oh, because, so she is, better than up, I am. because she is placing concern on, on the item. And it was more about the concern or the urgency of my concern that she didn't care about. But here's the thing. He told me that. Oh, How yeah. many times do couples don't? I have no idea why he's throwing a fit about this, thinking it's like no big deal, let it go. And, and he finally tells me, here's why. Here's the why. And we've talked about joining before. And yes, it was insignificant. And even it's insignificant. Yep. But the point is that I didn't join him in his concern. And this is a very minor thing. This is really little. It's not like, oh, I have to be careful. Make sure Tim that I'm concerned. I just would have went out of my way to make sure the item that she was concerned about, I would have placed that concern on myself and would have, okay. She labeled this thing by exactly. name. So I'm going to go make sure that I have that thing that she named. Now, honestly, I could have forgot my wallet on the beach, but that one stupid free thing that I named, it's... The concern was there. Yeah. Yeah, it was about the concern, not about... Not about the bag. Not about the bag. Yeah. 
which is fun. I mean, this doesn't happen all the it's time. So it's not, it is kind of silly. <laughs> but here's the the biggest thing we learned is he voiced exactly what the root of the issue was, and I listened and went, she was "Okay, listening. hello." Now that makes more sense rather than you being concerned over something I don't even care about. That makes more sense. I apologize. I'm really sorry. And then guess what? Friends that stayed at the beach, they actually brought it home with them. Like, is this yours? <laughs> like, yes! You have no idea what that just cost. <laughs> you bought my free crap home. Awesome. 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 Way to bring that home. Exactly. But I think that was the biggest thing. It was the listening. He he got straight to it. We could have bickered and argued and bitched and Maybe we should have done that. That would have been awesome. Just to complain and argue. It's That's what way. people do. And then they get big. And then he could go off and go, oh, she just doesn't care. She just doesn't care. And I'm like, why is he so concerned? I could have drank just... in my sorrows. <laughs> in For a, a bag. Of vodka. With a bag. With a... Over a bag. <laughs> Again, it's not <laughs> that big of a deal. <laughs> See, she still doesn't care. <laughs> <laughs> but, All right. Okay, go. Cool. Um, <laughs> yeah, thank you for interrupting me a whole lot there. Um, I yes. lost my train of thought. I'm sorry. <clears throat> Now that it's not being about the bag and actually have the conversation, and after the fact, it was really nice just to kind of get to the point rather than yeah. drawing the whole thing out. Yes. And then it just it just compounds and gets into a bigger and bigger yeah. deal. You don't know how I feel. I can't explain anything to you. Yeah. Well, just get over yourself and say, this is how I'm feeling and this is how you hurt my feelings. Do you... And the other person should validate yes. that. And then and then you kind of just move on with your life. Of, yeah, that's yep, a resolve. It was kind of stupid. The bag was kind of dumb. You understand that I wanted I wanted you to have the same concern that I have. Yes, it's over free crap, but I wanted you to experience the same concern that I have. Now that you understand that, deal done. Let's go have sex. <laughs> it was that kind of an argument? Everything that ends in sex. <laughs> make up, yeah, the faster you get done with an argument, the faster you get to make up sex. Why don't you people understand that? Maybe that's why women leave it on, because they don't want them to go back. Oh. Because they let it drag on. Well, that's a stupid way around. That's another issue altogether. Yeah. All right. That's it. That's really it. So go back and watch our video from last <clears throat> week if you didn't get to, or just put a podcast with your you know, vacuum in or drive in or whatever. It, there's a lot of good information. And visit us on... Haveamarriage.com. Um, you can follow us on Twitter at the same address, and you can follow us on Instagram at the same handle. Hello. I'm almost going to say, um, we're close to just saying have a marriage everywhere. Um, it's awesome. For now, follow Tammy on her YouTube uh, page. And that's it. Oh, and one more thing. The list. Um, the list. If you don't know about the list yet. <clears throat> so we have 150 different sex acts that you need to go through this list of I will do to, or I will fine. not do and go through it with your partner. It would make a great date night and yep. actually may change the way you do things in the bedroom. Um, it's on haveamarriage.com. It's a fun thing to do. I think we sat down and just and she played a video game and I'm like, would you do this? Yes. Would you do this? No. And <laughs> why would you not do this? Would you try this? Would you do it at least once? Um, so that's all covered in the list. It's an actual fun thing to do. And that's on haveamarriage.com down at the bottom in the seedy sexual step. Um, <laughs> seedy. All seedy right. Sexual. We love you guys. If you have uh, <laughs> questions, if you have... Uh, Comments, questions, comments, or if topics, you have any topics sorry. that you would like us to discuss, um, we'll discuss any topic that you want. Um, if it's obviously sexual in nature, we'll put it into the private group because... And we'll um, put the link. Little ones. That. But um, little ones. Yeah. Other than that, um, have a great day. We love you. And uh, Batman says, you should watch your head, man. <laughs>